Hello and welcome to this Lens Studio tutorial. In this video, you're going to learn how you can segment the sky and change the texture of the sky in Lens Studio. All of the resources that I'm using in order to make this lens will be down in the description below. And yeah, let's get started. So here's how you can make that lens. In order to make this lens, we're going to use a template. Search for the multi-segmentation template in Lens Studio. This template will allow us to change the sky segmentation easily. Once the project is being opened, you will also see this dialog box. Just click on update. Once the template is open, this is the screen that you will see. You can see that the sky is being segmented perfectly and there is also a GIF right here. GIF is a moving image. To change this, you can come to the objects panel. Here, I'm going to turn off the post effects, the ground and the plants so that just the sky is being segmented. To change this GIF of the sky, click on the tile GIF and here you can see that the tile GIF material is being used. You can edit this by coming into your materials and searching for the tile GIF edit mode. Here you can add any GIF that you want. You can directly import GIFs into Lens Studio by clicking on the add new resource in your resource panel and the GIF icon. Here I'm going to search for star. You can see that there are a lot of options. I'm going to choose this one right here and click on add as a resource. This will be added directly into your resource panel. Next, in your tile GIF material, click on the base texture and add in your GIF. You can see that your GIF is added here. You can change the number of times this is being repeated. You can also make this move on both the X axis and on the Y axis. If you want to add an image to your sky, you can do that as well. First, I'm going to change the move X and move Y to zero. Next, you need to add the image that you want to be on your sky. I'm going to go and download the image that I want to use. Download an image that is copyright free. Here, I'm going to go into upsplash.com and search for any image that you want. All of these images are copyright free. Just click on download and it will get downloaded. Next, import it into your resources panel by clicking on resource, add a new resource and import file. Now click on tile gif edit me and drag and drop this image into the base texture. You can see that your image is added. You can move this, allow your image to move on the x axis and y axis to make it look a little more cinematic. You can also change the number of times this is being tiled in order to have a smoother animation. And yeah, this was how you can change your sky texture in Nunstone. If you like the tutorial, click here to find more such tutorials. You can also subscribe to me and press that bell icon to never miss another tutorial.